Hello beautiful people of the world, today I'm coming at you with another video and this one is my TMI tag. How are you all today? Are you doing good? That's very fantastic. Anyways, I was tagged by the lovely Ava and without further ado, let's get straight on into it. Number one, what are you wearing? I am actually wearing this crop top from Hollister and I'm wearing this movie world white shorts that I have on. They're very comfortable to sit in. Two, have you ever been in love? I'm in love right now. Three, have you ever had a terrible breakup? Well, Every single breakup is sort of terrible. It really depends on your outlook, on the relationship and on life, if you're positive, if you're not. But even the most positive person, no breakups are completely amazing. You're always gonna be upset, so of course I have. Four, how tall are you? I am 169 centimeters. And because I love you all, I'm going to be translating that to feet because even people in Australia understand feet, but somehow I still don't. Let's just say 5 feet and 6 inches. Number 5, how much do you weigh? I have not weighed myself in over 2 years. Number 6, any tattoos? Nope, 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 nope. I'm not cool enough. Just the way it is. 7, any piercings? Yes, I have the normal ones, I have the double ones, I have the cornea one, and I have this one. Now, I completely forgot all of those names, but I'm planning to get a lot more. I really want some. Number 8, by the way, I'm gonna run out of these hands very soon because it's gonna go up to 50 and I'm not gonna be like... Number 50! <laughs> so number 8, OTP. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Do not get me started! Oh my god, my boys. Do not get me started with OTPs. Where the hell am I even gonna start? There's Caleb and Hannah from Pretty Little Liars. There's Seth and Summer from The O.C. There's Tatiana and Alexander from The Summer Garden, my favorite book. There is Chuck and Blair. Oh my god. Okay, everyone loves Chuck and Blit, but my most favorite OTP is Serena and Dan. I mean, come on, they are amazing together. Kanye and Kim, do not judge me. Beyonce and Jay-Z. Okay, I'm getting way ahead of myself. Ooh, zen, Rita, zen. Number nine, favorite show. I have a lot, and I'm going to be doing a video about all my favorite TV shows. But my number one is Friends. Ten, favorite bands, Fall Out Boy. Full stop. 11. Something you miss. I miss my family in Russia. Favorite song. My favorite song of all time is Naive by The Cooks. All time favorite. I will never ever change that. But my favorite at the moment has to be Cockiness by ASAP Rocky and that's the 813 remix. 13. How old are you? I am 19 years old. 14. Libra. Wait. My question. Uh, zodiac sign. I am a Libra. Because <gasps> I'm indecisive like that. 15. Quality you look for in a partner. He has to be tall. Wait, that's not a quality. He has to be loyal, understanding, and funny. And trustworthy. But looks are all that matters, am I right, ladies? Favorite quote. It's either, in spite of everything, I still believe people are really good at heart. And that's by Anne Frank. That is so powerful. Or you're still going to get criticized so you might as well do whatever the fuck you want. Where do you go when you're sad? Into my boyfriend's arms. But in all seriousness, my boyfriend because he makes me a million times better. If not that, then editing videos because it makes me forget about everything and super passionate about it so I'm just pushes all the bad and I'm just concentrating and working but it's not really work for me because I love it how long does it take you to shower five minutes if I'm just washing my body and brushing my teeth and about 15 minutes when I'm washing my hair because it's really thick and conditioning and all that how long does it take you to get ready in the morning if it's just makeup and hair wise then probably like half an hour ever been in a physical fight nope turn on blue eyes Big arms, turn offs, when the guy knows that he is attractive, like cocky he knows that he's attractive. 
except Kanye West is an exception. The reason I joined YouTube, two main reasons. Number one being is I'm very, very passionate. So I'm passionate in filmmaking, as in I have been wanting to do it since I was 12 and I have been taking the camera out everywhere, filming myself. I'm doing a degree that focuses in film production and my passion for fashion. Holy shit, I did not mean to say it like that. Wow. Oh my god, I have a passion for fashion. Fears. I am so scared of heights. Like if I look down on something and I'm just like, holy shit, that's really high. Last thing that made you cry. I don't know if you can see this, but this is my dog. It didn't go really deep in, but it was just so shocking and I was just in shock that I started to cry because it was so unexpected. Like, we wanted to take him out for a walk and he started growling. He doesn't like when I put the collar on him to go for a walk. It's like an association, I think, of like me intimidating him or overpowering him which is really really not good at all i should be training him not to do that and i have been trying last time you said you loved someone i said i loved my boyfriend last night i think meaning behind your youtube name okay so i made this youtube channel in 2007 i believe and there's this thing going around like think pink i don't know that's a really famous saying now but before like everyone knew about it i don't know about now like i, I haven't heard it for years for like a decade or something but i was just like pink is my favorite color so I was like, Rita thinks pink. It was a time where my primary school friends were all very, very small and stupid and our favorite color was pink. And I'm kidding you not. We were battling to see who liked pink the most. We would make scrapbooks all dedicated to the color pink. I am not joking, it sounds so ridiculous right now, but for real. I was just like, I'm gonna make my YouTube name Rita thinks pink. So it looks like I am the one that loves pink the most. Last book you read. I have been a very bad girl. I have not read in such a long time, maybe a year or something, so I don't remember. The book you're currently reading, that just answers the last question, and um, I haven't been reading for a long time. I should, but I haven't. Last show you watched. Gossip Girl. I love Gossip Girl. Last place you were, walking my dog outside, your current crush. I mean, I have a boyfriend, so I guess I'm crushing on my boyfriend. Last time you kissed someone, about two hours ago. Last time you were insulted. I think probably my boyfriend, he said something like as a joke and I took it seriously and he was like, I'm joking. Favorite flavor of sweet. I'm actually allergic to lollies, but it has to be chocolate anyways. What instrument do you play? I play boys, you know what I'm saying? I play them like a gay. I don't play an instrument. Really not talented at all. Favorite piece of jewelry? Necklaces. And in that range, it'll have to be this beautiful choker right here. Last sport you played. <laughs> you get you get, you get this I don't play sport. Last song you played. I don't fuck with, I don't give a I don't give a I don't favorite chat up line. Are you a magician? Because I broke a damn! And next question, no, I have never used that on anyone. And if I do, please shoot me in the face. Last time you hung out with anyone. Does my boyfriend count? I guess last night. Who should answer these questions next? Literally anyone who wants to do this tag and just comment down below saying, Rita, I've done this tag. Come watch it. I will watch it and I will probably love it and laugh. Anyways guys, I really hope that you like this video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And as always, thank you for watching. Bye everyone.